best virgin I've ever laughed at. <laughs> well, the first time. Anyway, my name's Amy Oppie, and I'm so proud to be here tonight. You know, I just found out today that I have 82 subscribers on my YouTube page, y'all. It's A-M-Y-O-P-P-Y apostrophe S comedy. Y'all can be one of those subscribers. Look me up. Then I don't have to tell you the past so you can figure it all out, you know? Because I'm one of those storytellers that only gets five minutes at a time. I drove almost three hours to get here, though. I live in New Braunfels, and I made it through snow big 21. How about y'all? Woo, 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 woo. Yay. I, too, had the vaccine, you know. But uh, someone said there were 31 in a midlife crisis. Well, I'm 61, still having fun. Fuck that midlife crisis. I, I don't know what he was talking about. You know, I plan to live twice this long because I've been really living it up. And if you look at my YouTube, Oppie's comedy, you'll figure that one out. Then I'm going to tell you my favorite thing. She's talking about masturbation. To me, that's the only way to keep you in a good relationship at this age, you know? You know how to satisfy yourself? You don't get disappointed? <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. And you know, the cool thing is, the cool thing is, when you get old, things get wrinkled, right? And there ain't nothing bad about a wrinkled vagina. Like a flavor saver, you know what I'm saying? <laughs>
Yolanda Salazar was brought up today. And guess what? She was on the other side of the cell from me one time when I was doing SAG time in prison. No kidding. That's the first time I got to hear Selena's song. And what's funny about that? Who thought I'd end up a stone's throw away from that woman's memorial? What do you think? I mean, not Yolanda. She had a lot of shit to remember about her. Her grandma used to visit her, and we don't have to go on lockdown while she walked up there for her grandma to sit in the eating chair. We all hated that bitch, but anyway. <laughs> We waited in line to, uh, to Henry Winkler, I know we don't know the Fonzie, and Ron Howard were at the Montgomery Wards in Maryland, waiting around there for everyone to kiss them. No shit, that was way pre-COVID, trust me. Pre-AIDS too. Yeah. <laughs> That's how old I am. And I remember, anytime I mentioned to my mother, she might not remember her name or my name or where the hell she is, but she sure as fuck remembers kissing the Fonz. <laughs> Thank you.